Okay, now you want to uh, get your uh, longest piece. Yeah, your longest piece of wire, which is like this. And get uh, your diode, which is this. You see the gray right here? You want that point pointing down facing the Xbox. So, you want it pointing down facing the Xbox, the gray part. You couldn't really see that. So, you want to take it, and you want to wrap it around your wire, like so. wrap it around and then once you got it wrapped around add some solder to it so I'll be right back and I'll show you when I'm done and it should look like this all soldered in I accidentally soldered it wrong the gray is pointing the other way but you want it to point down okay so here you got your point and the same exact thing I told you uh, oh crap that's the xenon I don't have a xenon on the same exact thing I told you. The same way to solder it. Not in hard, but this is a different point. So let me just move the camera up. Let me, let me just take the camera. All right, where's the knife? Okay, so you want to solder the end of this, that end, to this stupid point. Not the point that this one went to. No. You don't do anything with the bridge, you just put that aside. To this point. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, because I'm so stupid. Take the point. The soldering gun. Into the point. And behind. It's a bit complicated. Stop at that yacht. Alright. And now it's dangling. I like when it dangles. That's what she said. So it's in that point. Pretty nice. Sorry, focus is not right. so well. So once you got it into that point. You then want to get your um, oh, baby board or whatever, and you want it to solder it to the uh, diode. You want to solder it to this point right there. So like the second one, the first pin right there, the second pin. So I'm trying to get a better way to show you this. All right. So there's the first one. This one you solder it to. This one right here. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. I'll show you when I'm done. Okay, so I finished it. This how it looks. To the second point. So you can see. Yeah, it's imperfect. So then that JTAG point is done. You're halfway done with the JTAG. So now you want to get other strand of wire, but a bit smaller. Uh, and you want to get your other diode, which I have um, somewhere. Hold on. All right, so you get your diode again. This time you're going to want to snip. Cut it short. So the one with the gray at the tip, you're going to cut it short. So I'm about there. Boom. Exact same thing. Wrap it around your wire. And then once it's wrapped around, you want to go solder. So I'm going to solder it, so I'll be right back. Okay, I finished. That's how it looks. It's not. Uh, let me just hold this up. Sorry. You could plug that in, but I'm not going to plug that in right now. So, you see the second point right next to it. That point right there. I'm going to solder 
not the diode, but the end of the wire to that point. So let me just do that now. Alright. One. Stop it. Sorry if you can't see well. Kimberly, it's me, it's me a Jarrett. Sorry. Just had to say that. Alright, so you got it in. Yeah, you want to stick that baby in there. Make sure. So she said. Once it's in there. Then want to solder the diode to this point. So I'll show you when I'm done. All right. So once you're done with that, you're done with the JTAG points. You're complete. You're all done. Nothing to do. Just plug this back in. Now you want to dump the NAND. So I have NAND X. This is what I'm using. The points you're going to solder this to is here and there. So right now I'm going to show you one point to solder it and then uh, I'll show you when it's complete. Alright, so now I got the first point completed for the uh, the NAND to dump. It's the third point down. As you can see, the third point down. And uh, I got the rest of this to go. And then I'm going to plug that into the NAND X. All the JTAG points are in. Everything's fine. And uh, yeah, let's go. Alright guys, I finished all the connections, they're all in, all in, leading to the NAND X. I'm going to plug the NAND X into here. I would go to, computer screen, can I do this, hot girl, open up JTAG tool, I'm going to go down to USB, your console type of a Zephyr, and you want to hit read NAND, and it's reading. Uh, all right. Once you uh, yeah, yeah, Han. Once you uh, finish reading the NAND, which I did, you want to uh, compare, which is here and one. I already did that. They're uh, fine. Once you re compare them, then you're gonna want to uh, write Excel. And then once you are writing Zell, uh, you wait till that's all writ, and it uh, doesn't take that long. It takes like I don't know a minute. Yeah, not even. So Excel installed, and then you want to turn your Xbox on. Make sure you unplug NAND. Keep everything soldered in. Unplug it in, and then you're gonna look for uh, go down to here. I'm gonna look for fuse set three. And fuse set four. Put those together. You're gonna get your uh, CPU key. Okay. You put it in here, and then you create bin, and then you're gonna write the bin. So like, uh, it's not that hard to do. Um, I'll give you a link in the description to that. And that's how you guys. That's how you guys. Uh, JTAG and Xbox. Please uh, comment, rate, subscribe. Peace.